Hey guys, welcome back to my video. Today I'm going to teach you how to do the LMG count. It looks like this. I have one, two, three, four cards. Four black cards, but do I actually have them? I actually have a red card right there. Stick around for the tutorial. Alright, so LMZ's count. I'm assuming that a person whose name is Elmsy created this. Um, it's really useful when you're doing Devil's Elevator or um, rotating aces or something like th like that. I'll have tutorials in the future. I will figure out the correct name for the aces. Anyways, basically, if you have four cards like so and a red card or a black card. Here, you will never see this card positioned second from the bottom. I'll show you what I mean. I have one, two, three, four cards, but you never actually saw my red eight, right? So this is what's going to happen. Here, this is what's actually going to happen. I have one card, and I'm gonna push a card and grab onto this nine of spades like so, and then grab these two cards, see, like 9 and the 8, like so, but like you, I'll be concealing in my performance. I actually have two cards here, and then one more, and one more. So let's get to the grip. Um, I feel like grip is really, really important in this. What I normally do is I would hold onto it right in the middle, or right under the middle with your right, with my right hand, one thumb right here, perpendicular to this uh, deck and I would have my index finger and the ring finger holding at the very bottom. This is the grip and with your left thumb you're just going to slide one card off like that, right? This is a motion. You don't want to change your motion too much because when you're moving your, uh, let's say you're a lefty, this is what, this is how you would count a new deck of cards, right? You would bring in, bring in, you won't go like this, right? You would keep your right hand steel, still, and you would come with your left hand and grab it. And if you're righty, this would look like this, right? Your right, uh, your left finger, left hand that's holding the deck will hold still while your right hand does all the movements. So that's what you're going to try to imitate because you don't want the spectator, spectator to be suspicious, right? So I want you to grab four cards, three black cards, and one red card like what I did here. I'm using four cards, by the way. Um, for me, I used eight of clubs, eight of spades, and nine of spades, and a nine of hearts. Um, it's better if you uh, choose cards that has a lot of numbers, like a high number cards, like what I'm doing here. I don't know why, but psychologically, um, it helps with a trick. So going back to the grip, this is a grip, and you're going to, for the first card, you're going to slide off one card like so. You're going to push with your with your thumb, your and your index finger. You're going to slide only one card off like that, right? If you do it, what I'm doing. If you understand what I'm doing, you're going to slide off one card like so, and that you're only going to slide one card, and then take it out from the pile and give it to this hand, your left hand. And when that's happening, with your right hand, you're going to push the deck like this. You're gonna push like that, like that, like this, okay? And it, what basically you're doing is that you're pushing two cards at the same time, right? Like it just happens. It's not something that you practice. If you hold it in this grip and then push with your thumb, you're gonna push two cards. That just happens. I don't know why, but it just happens. You push like that, you push two cards. Now, difficult thing about this is that you don't, like as long as you don't f push and flash, it's perfectly safe. So again, you're gonna hold it in this grip. You're gonna push your thumb up while with your uh, using your right finger, up, right left finger, left left thumb and your left index finger. You're gonna push one card up like this, bring it to your left hand, and as you are doing that, you're going to push with your right thumb like so. It's okay if you flash like that much, but just don't flash the red. You're gonna push like that, two cards, and then while your left hand is coming in, you're going to give the nine of spades, 
by sticking it at the very bottom like so right nine of spades going at the very bottom and then what as soon as that happens you're going to grab these two cards using the squishy part of your hand you're going to grab it like this and pull these two cards off without flashing the red card and then your thumb right thumb is going to continue sliding like this and then you're going to you're going to come in like this and like that that's basically the basic movement let's go over it again hold it in this grip you're going to slide one card off and then your your thumb is going to start sliding like this your right thumb is going to start sliding like this and then this while you're doing that you're going to hand off the eight of clubs and then with using this squishy part of your left hand you're going to grab the two cards right two cards right here grab it like this and your thumb is going to continue sliding like that and one more card and one more card so basically your thumb is continually sliding like this slowly okay so at the start you want to practice really slow you're going to go one push and while you're giving it off like this handing it off you're going to keep pushing um, grab the double with your left hand left squishy part and then your thumb is going to keep sliding off like that hand off one more card using your thumb strip one card and the last one okay again like if you're if you get the hang of it this is what it would look like for me I think I have a pretty good idea or pretty good understanding of what it looks like and I think I'm almost flawless in a sense if I'm using a decent deck of cards see I'm not flashing my red at all and also one important thing you want to have the red card or whatever you want to take us uh, keep it keep it hit, hidden from second from the bottom like so what I'm doing right I have one two second bottom bottom so basically this if you are good at it that's what's going to happen let's go over it really quick again this is a grip two fingers your index and your middle finger at the back your thumb at the front don't flash like I just said hold it tight not too tight though and then coming in with your left hand you're gonna strip one card off pull it up like this as if you're dealing and then while that's happening your thumb is going to start rolling like start sliding off like this meaning you're going to leave, uh, slide two cards in a row leaving one card at the very back and then you're going to change you're going to hand off this card take off take these two cards right you're going to hand off at the very bottom like that like this so you're going to hand it off like this and while that's happening you're going to grab these two cards with your squishy part and your thumb is still sliding like this and then strip one card off with your thumb you're seeing your left thumb like so here i'll show you that again while your thumb is sliding off your left thumb is stripping one card and stripping another card and that's basically what the tutorial is i'll show you what it looks like if you go fast and this is what it's going to look like right again your thumb like you can see my thumb constantly sliding right you can just see it constantly sliding that's what's happening guys i hope you like the tutorial if you get this tutorial you can now perform uh two more tricks that involve this application it's a really strong uh technique that you can use in many tricks i hope you liked it if you like it give it a thumbs up and subscribe i'll see you next time